Hey everyone, I'm going to show you a tip to make your RSS posts look a lot better. As you know, Socialmonials has a feature where you can add your RSS feed, be it your blog or your YouTube channel, even Bing keyword searches. As long as there's an RSS feed that we can attach to, you can convert those new posts to that feed into social media posts on all of your social networks. So, to make it look a little better, uh, there's a plugin I want to show you guys how you can use. It's totally free and it really helped us have a much better um, experience because we also use Socialmonials to post to social media. And I want to show you what happened to us and how we fixed it. So this is our blog. Uh, we have all these nicely manicured main images. So as you know with WordPress you can set a primary image and that's what these are right here. The problem is when we would import this to our RSS feed, it would look something like this. And here's the reason why. The feed from WordPress by default actually does not put out the image URL of your primary images. It doesn't put out any image URLs. So what you need to do is use a plugin and the reason you're seeing any images at all is that we put out our best effort to try to find a good image to use, but all that we do is when we don't see an image specified in your feed, we actually visit your page, scrape each page individually, and grab an image off the page. So we're kind of guessing at which image to show in your post. And as you can see, there's kind of mixed results. It's not too bad. But, you know, these are images that are shown a little further down in the blog post. And I really want it to look nice and neat, just like these images. So what we did is we found this plugin called Featured Images in RSS for MailChimp and more. So what you'll want to do is copy this. We're going to link this up in the comments, but let me show you what we did. Go to Plugins and Add New. And this is totally free. You don't need the premium version. So what I did was I plugged it into search and it was able to find it right away. So this is the one we want. It's used in over 30,000 um, websites already. So it, it's very trustworthy. So now it's installed, just activate it. And all of the defaults seem to work really well for our purposes. So medium large seemed to be actually a really good size. You can test different sizes, but this one worked super well for us. And we just left everything the way it is. Um, you could save it if you want. I don't think it's even necessary. Um, and that's it. So now what I want to do is go back to Socialmonials and let's try this again. I'm going to delete these four posts and we are going to import the last four posts again. It'll be these exact same posts, but we'll see how it looks after the um, plugin was installed. I'm gonna go back to RSS. Let's grab the RSS feed URL, and I'm going to delete this old one, and let's just add it totally new. Add RSS feed. I'm going to pull in the title and description to create a post and let's call this Sosha Moan just so I can um, filter for it and not scroll through a whole bunch of posts wasting your time. I'm just going to select a couple of um, social networks. Let's attach image. This is exactly what I did last time. Let's see how it looks now. Let's wait till this hits four. Okay, so the same four posts were imported. Let's see how they look. So we have hundreds of posts in our um, test account. So I'm just gonna filter for it here and look at how much nicer this looks. It used our primary image. So now when I go in, if I edit this, You 
It's got just the right image and all is well in the world. So that's my recommendation to you. Um, look in the comments for this link and this free plugin will make your posts um, that are automated much more attractive and save you more time. Thanks a lot.